So here we're at one end of the hallway at ITC. We can see that we have an odometry frame and a world frame, as well as the base frame. And it's scanning most of the hallway. This is a staircase right over here. And then outside we have a bunch of trees. And even without moving, we actually capture a good chunk of the hallway to begin with. We're gonna start moving in a second and you will see how Blam is able to capture rooms by walking inside of them, as well as rooms by walking past them if they have windows. So now we start walking. Let's take a view from the top. You can see that the algorithm is tracking where we are. And as we walk past the room, it populates it with point clouds, which are then sort of updated more densely as we enter the room. Now we're exiting the room. As we continue to walk, we can see there is a significant, um, there's more mapping of the, of the trees outside sort of automatically. The range of the sensor, the Velodyne, the VLP-16 is about 100 meters. We enter another room. You can see that it very densely maps it. get a third room we can walk by and map it goes quite successfully And now just walking past the rooms, we can see that it's able to scan pretty well just by, this is sort of the elevator bay, just by walking past the rooms, right? You don't even have to go inside of them, but by scanning through the windows that are transparent to the frequencies, due to the wavelengths of the light that the Valadine is emitting and receiving, um, it can scan the whole room. So now we'll continue to the end of the hallway, which terminates right around here. stairs about to pop up over here. Those are the stairs and then that is the terminus of the scam. So let's take a look from a bird's eye view at what we've got. Try to rotate that, shall we? So this hallway ostensibly is quite straight in real life and Blam was able to capture that pretty well. And we can see that the detail inside the rooms is actually pretty high. So if we look inside we can see people, this one you can see a bunch of desks, which was the case in reality. So overall, it does a great job.